हे गाइस आई एम आदित्य एंड वेलकम टू वन पिक्सल यूट्यूब चैनल गाइस करंटली यू आर ऑडियो यू आर लिसनिंग हैज नो एडिटिंग बट एज यू कैन लिसन टू दिस ऑडियो इट हैज लॉट ऑफ एनहेंसमेंट एंड एडिड एक्स्ट्रा बेस टू इट इन टू डेज वीडियो आई एम गोन टीच यू हाउ कैन यू ऑल्सो एडिट यूर ऑडियो समथिंग लाइक दिस यूजिंग प्रीमियर प्रो सॉफ्टवेयर सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड बिफोर वी गो इन टू आवर कंप्यूटर स्क्रीन यू मस्ट कीप समथिंग्स इन टू योर माइंड वाइल रिकॉर्डिंग योर ऑडियो नो बैकग्राउंड नॉइज शुड बी रिकॉर्डेड इन टू योर ऑडियो इट डजेंट रियली मैटर यू आर यूजिंग ए माइक और योर स्मार्टफोन टू रिकॉर्ड योर ऑडियो जस्ट कीप द माइक टू नियर टू योर माउथ एंड द एयर ऑफ योर माउथ शुड नॉट गो इन टू योर माइक सो नाउ लेट्स गो टू आवर कंप्यूटर स्क्रीन एंड लेट्स नो हाउ टू एड सम एक्स्ट्रा बेस टू योर ऑडियो सो एज यू गैस कैन सी नाउ वी आर ऑन अवर कंप्यूटर स्क्रीन एंड हियर इज एन ऑडियो file which we are going to edit so first of all guys you need to open your premier pro software so let us open our premier pro software and this is very much easy and simple so you can follow me and edit your audio something like this so first of all you need to create a new project and you can give it a name as well so let us click on this okay button and after opening your premier pro you must click double tap on your project panel so after clicking here you can drag your audio uh, file to it okay so let us import our audio file after importing your audio file you must click on your audio file and drag it to your timeline after doing this simple step first of all we need to remove the background noises from this audio so to do this you must click on this fx panel after going here you should search denoise so let us search denoise quickly and after searching denoise you can see here a denoise plugin here okay so you must click on this plugin and drag it to your audio so after doing this you can go to your effect controls and you can see a denoise panel here so after coming to denoise you must click on this edit button after clicking here you can see the amount you can adjust from here so from here you can adjust your denoise as much as you want for me i can keep here up to uh, 10% so you can select according to your audio so if you uh, want to listen your audio you can click space bar on your keyboard and you can also adjust after clicking on this to check the audio is it correct or not so let me keep it to 10% and let's close this window so after doing this you should click uh, on this cut button and you must search for another plugin which is named as parametric equalizer so let us search parametric equalizer and you must also drag to your audio so after doing this you should click on this edit button and you should click on this default button and after clicking on this you can click on the max loudness maximizer button so after doing this you can see here two buttons which is l and h okay so l means lower parts of your audio and h means higher parts of your audio so you can click on this space button on your keyboard to check your audio it will run on your background so now you need to adjust the base of your audio to do that you must uh, hold this l button uh, which is lower parts of audio so you can Im increase your lower parts of your audio here you can also adjust the higher parts of your audio as well so you must uh, try this and experiment with this to get perfect base with your audio so after adjusting this you should click on this cut button so now our base has been improved so now let us keep another plugin here which is multi brand compressor so let us search multi band compressor and after searching it you must click on this plugin button and again you should drag to your audio so after dragging it here you can click on the edit button and you should click on this default button and you must select the broadcast button okay so after clicking on this you should cut this audio so after doing this your audio has been lot more enhanced by default but your audio's voice has lot of lot more increase to adjust this you should click left click on this audio and now right click and after clicking it you can see some panels now you should click on this audio gain button and let us keep to minus 10 so after doing it you can click on this okay button now your audio has been perfectly edited and optimized now also you can if you want you can edit the denoise as well as uh, if you want more uh, noise reduction you can adjust from here now guys your audio has been successfully edited to export it you must click on this file button and export button and media button after coming it here you can select the format which is mp3 so after clicking on this you can uh, check the bit rates and uh, all those and let us click on the export button i wish guys you have enjoyed this video if you like this video then definitely give a thumbs up and i will catch you up in the next one